One dungeon. Two, three, four, five, uh, six, there we go. Seven, finally got the daily out of the way. We, what's up dudes and dudes in the air now? My name's Seth and we are back, Yumper the Troll. How y'all doing today, folks? Hope you're doing fantastic and wonderful. Hope this video makes your day even better. Oh my goodness gracious, everybody. We got some exciting stuff going on. <gasps> and first of all, there's actually been a mini patch today. So we'll talk about that before we get into the craziness of today's episode, which is going to be introducing the Savage Frog Army into our lore. So what's actually going on right now as far as new content is concerned is this new motorcycle. Shout out to Chronozilla because she ended up throwing me a code that I guess she got from the person who made this which was spree and stealth 545 so thank you to them by her giving me something and yeah either way this is actually my favorite motorcycle to date because honestly speaking i don't really care for these motorcycle mounts they never were very cool even way back when they introduced the neon bike nobody really liked them but this one is actually really really cool i think it fits very very well with our beautiful costume and just in general i really like the way that the flame looks which i think is the same fire vfx of the Primordial Legendary Dragon, so rip that dragon. And then also the most important thing, you're gonna know is Chaos Chests are spiking in price. Maybe that'll end up going back down, but Ninth Lifes are in the Chaos Chest rotation right now, everybody, so that is absolutely insane. Okay, and so for today, everybody, we're actually gonna be exploring the Savage Frog Army. Now, the way that these guys fit into our lore, I haven't come up with the Pirate Sharks or the uh, Cthulhu Mythos over there or anything like that just yet, and I'm slowly trying to think of an idea of what I'm gonna end up doing with the whole Yabaki thing because, I mean, devs keep talking about it, finally getting in game after like five years, but honestly speaking, who knows, who cares? So the Savage Frog Army, quite simply put, if you didn't already catch this, they're amphibian warriors that are really, really stupid, you know? So they think they're like really, really good and they think they can keep up with the other factions, but they're kind of on the side and nobody really knows they even exist because of how bad they are. You know, they're kind of like the lovable losers and that's that's exactly why they're cool. So this one, uh, this club was actually created by Merc and Critters in it and there's a couple other people in it and we're gonna go through the little bit of the lore that we've got here and see whether or not we end up getting rewarded at the end. But before we end up starting today with all of that, we're going to be giving away quite a few prizes. Thank you to Slaps for Days, Snappy Omega, Mega, uh, Bubble Anchor, and Nintendo Gamer. We're going to be giving away four tomes of poop. <laughs> so that's going to be the tome that just gives you the rich fertilizer. It's... It's more of a joke prize today, folks, honestly speaking, so I'm not going to be surprised if nobody wants it. But on top of just earning the prizes, also just supporting the videos, I would appreciate if you would hit the like button, be subscribed to the channel, leave a comment in the comment section down below with your username, and Scarlet the Spire will let you know, hey, dude, you won, and then you catch either myself or Nintendo Gamer, or just catch us on our Discord. Links are in the description for everything. So, anyways, let's get to it. Hello, Frog King, my liege. Hello there, my good sir. I am the Frog King. And I rule over these lads. I suppose you're wondering why you're here. Wait, you're? You you are? I don't know if that's a typo, but if it is, leave it there. Many ships pass by our island just like yours. No ship has ever survived these waters. You're lucky. Yeah, that's a typo, all right? Leave it like that, though. It's very dank. You're a lucky soul to be alive. Well, now that you're here, I could... Oh, boy. Uh, I could use some help. There's been a giant golden fly that has been attacking our village recently. I wish that Trova actually had quests like this. This would be so much better. I need you to go out there and kill it for us so the food chain can be restored. The fly's cave is out in Merc's swamp. He is the wisest of the frogs and our strongest warrior. We should, why, we would send him out to kill the beast, but that wouldn't fit the plot now, would it? I love breaking the fourth wall. It is absolutely great, seriously. This is awesome, and I, hopefully you're all gonna enjoy it. You can always join the club world as you saw from the portal that we have in our club, uh, and throw a prop to his world as well. Help, help, I'm stuck in a tree, help me. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Do you mind? Because he's having a bath, and we're watching him. 
Don't actually do that. That's wrong. Even against frog fibians. Oh, and look, we can test our archery skills over here and our mind skills. Now, I don't really know how to uh, actually play whatever this game is. It's type of... Okay. There's the strongest warrior. I hope I can impress him. Let's see if we can get our archery. Oh. <laughs> I think he popped. Uh, so, are you impressed by this? Look at my aim. Look at- Whoa, look at him. He's so good. I can barely even hit the target. He's so good. He's actually even grappling himself to it, and he's very strategically pulling himself to the sign without pulling the sign to himself because he's that good at it. Well, anyways, let's go and see- Oh. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, that's right. So, uh, Merc Swamp we got here, and then we got this sign. I, I wanted to read this in order. It's like the Swamps of Dagobah from Star Wars, except it's not the Swamps of Dagobah, and Mer Merc isn't Yoda. <laughs> what is this one? Hello there. I seem to have lost my voice. Can you help me find it? Um, okay. And then what's this guy? He looks gross. Kill me. I deserve death. Yes, he do most certainly does. I don't know if we can do anything about it, though. Hey, what's that? What's that over there? Oh, look at this! It's the wise Merc. I see, look at this Merc's log. And since we're so skilled at this game, we can actually skip ourselves over the water uh, like a stone. But anyways, we gotta go and find that cave. I, I got a feeling it's gonna be over here by the mountains, just because, hey, what's this? Critter, okay. Oh, look, it's Critter. Hi, I'm Critter. I like to eat eyeballs. <laughs> uh. There's, there's something, there's so much wrong with that. Oh, look, I conveniently found it. I didn't totally know where this was. Oh, hello? What's happening here? Oh, great. A maze. I lost my friend in that maze back there. He's been gone for 20 years. You mean you've been waiting here for 20 years for your friend? Why didn't this guy starve to death or just get out of here? Like, seriously, what's wrong with him? Okay, let's see if we can get out of here. If my memory, I, I mean, my own personal skills, uh, yeah, because I'm using my skills right now to find my way through the maze. Um, it's totally not because I've already been through it once or twice. That is to say once and not entirely. Jeez Louise, so I think this one we have to kind of go by the edge of the screen or something, and the exit's like right there. Yeah, I think it's right over here, right? Yeah, okay, man, I'm good at this game. Oh, look, it's his friend. <laughs> I love how he's a skeleton, like seriously. Okay, now, oh boy, I don't know if I remember this part of the maze. I think we had to go forward? Oh man, and then over here? No, oh, that's dead, I can't find him. I don't know, it's like somewhere in the middle or something. That's the problem and I don't know where I am. Oh great, that's where he is, we gotta escape him. We have to escape. I'm pretty sure it's actually over here somewhere. I'm trying to lose him though. Uh, I'm totally tricking him. Their strongest warrior is secretly following us because he doesn't know uh, his way through the maze. So he has to come around to try and steal credit from us, right? Oh, wait a minute. Wasn't it like a secret pathway back here? Uh, 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 okay, we gotta run from him because he's like the Minotaur or the Minotaur. I think that's how people in the, the Europe Europeanese say it, right? Oh, he's leading us. I think he's leading us the right way. Oh, he's a chicken now. Okay, so maybe he's not leading us the right way. He's just going in circles because he's a crazy person. Aha! I knew it was over here the whole time. Hello, Frog King. What do you have to say about yourself? <laughs> Congratulations, you passed the test. What? Did you really think there was a golden fly hiding in a cave? This was just a test to see if you were worthy enough to join the Savage Frog Army. Oh, and even greater news is that we managed to salvage your ship and are rebuilding it as we speak. Soon we will be able to leave this island and conquer territories around the world, all thanks to you. Oh no, it's a shark man! Blah! All right, so anyways, there's a bunch of our cool stuff over here that I want to check out. Also, here, check this out. This I actually did. Uh, uh, here we go. Look at this. Don't you like it? it this is my special pirate shark uh, costume. He uses the face on his tummy to trick people into helping him, and then he robs them, because he's a shark. Whoa. 